Karnataka government has issued an Interpol blue corner notice against Prajwal Revanna, the grandson of former Prime Minister H.D. Devi Gowda. This came after close to 3,000 videos allegedly featuring Prajwal surfaced in Karnataka late last month, in which he is purportedly seen sexually exploiting hundreds of women. Prajwal, who is the NDA candidate from the Hassan seat in Karnataka, has since fled the country on a diplomatic passport, while his father, H.T. Revena, a JDS MLA, has been taken into custody on charges of allegedly abducting a woman who featured in one of the videos. Interpol's blue-collar notice is meant to collect additional information about a person's identity, location or activities in relation to a criminal investigation. There are seven types of notices, red corner, blue corner, you must have heard of it. So this blue corner is pertaining to, uh, which is issued by uh, uh, SIT Bangalore, which is investigating the cr criminal scandal which has happened in Bangalore. And basically the purpose of this blue corner notice is that international police, entire, all the members of um, uh, Interpol countries, including India, Basically, they have an arrangement, what they do, any, you know, location of the accused, what are the activities in which uh, accused is involved right now, and so on and so forth. So, these information will be given to the investigating agency, Indian uh, investigating agency. There are several types of Interpol notices. These are categorized as red, yellow, blue, black, green, orange, and purple notices. Usually a blue collar notice is issued after filing of criminal charges, whereas a red corner notice is meant to arrest a fugitive following a criminal conviction. In 2020, Interpol issued a blue notice to find fugitive Godman Nityananda, who had left the country in the middle of acquisitions of sexual abuse and rape in 2019. Blue corner notice once any member country out of the 196 member countries, if they confirm that the fugitive wanted by India is in their country, then further process is a formal arrest request is to be sent by, by the requesting country, that is India, to the concerned country. And we have countries with whom we have extradition uh, treaty, then we have MLAT request, so it, it is almost, uh, the procedure is, once it is located, then further steps are taken. While the blue corner Interpol notice is not an arrest warrant, in case Prajwal doesn't return to India to face criminal charges, the next step for investigating agencies could be to go for a red corner notice against him. The red corner notice is a request to law enforcement agencies worldwide to arrest a person pending their extradition, surrender or similar legal action. They are issued for fugitives wanted either for prosecution or to serve a sentence.